Hi, my name's Carla, and I just had knee replacement and surgery, so you can see in my compression stocking, there's a nice scar underneath there. So I'm walking around. It's, I had my knee surgery exactly two weeks ago today. I like to do my stretching on the floor, so I'm going to show you how to get down to the floor and up from the floor when you're really not able to bend and support yourself on your surgery leg. So my surgery leg is my right leg, so I'm going to be doing things with my left, and if your surgery leg is your left leg, then you can switch this around. But the key things are, you do need some arm strength, so I recommend before surgery, making sure that you have enough arm strength to um, support your body, like in a push-up, for example, if you practice your push-ups. So when I go to the floor, my idea is that I'm going to end up with my surgery leg straight and my good leg bent uh, in front of me. So I'm going to start in a position sort of like this with a, my good leg is in front of me perpendicular to my bad leg. I'm just going to put, bring my hands to the floor like this, sort of in a downward dog kind of position. Now I'm twisting my bad leg behind me and here I am. I am on the floor. And I, I have my shoes on, which allows me to both not slip too much and at the same time give me a little bit of sliding. But I recommend doing this on a carpet and then you will feel a little more comfortable about your potential not to fall. So I'll demonstrate that going down again after I go up. So here, this is the reason I like to be in this position is there's some of the exercises that I need to do that I like to do from the floor rather than a mattress which is soft. So it's nice to be able to do some of the exercises that I have to do. That way. So now I'm going to do the opposite for getting up. So to get up, I am going to take my good leg and I'm going to bend it, but I'm going to put it, cross it over my surgery leg. I'm going to cross it over my surgery leg and I'm going to put my same arm as my good leg down in front of me and then I'm going to lift up and when I'm lifting up I'm sort of in a three-legged dog if you know that move from yoga and then simply straighten out and here I am back up. So I'm going to demonstrate one more time. I don't recommend this if you don't have good arm strength, if you're not that flexible with your good non-surgery leg. But if you are and you want to get down on the floor to do some of your exercises, this is a good way that I found to get down. So you just, again, I'm going to go down pretty much in that three-legged dog if you have to stretch out. I'm going to stretch my right leg back, my surgery leg back, and twist my good leg so that I'm in kind of a, a sideways stretch position, if you like, supported by my surgery leg arm as well. Now I'm down, I can do, you know, my toe flexes and I can do my, my knee bends and I can try to straighten out my leg, which is also really important that I'm working on. And then when I'm ready to get up, I'm going to cross my good leg over, put the weight down, swing my foot around, and slowly roll up. Okay, that's it. That's your lesson for today. Hope you enjoy the film. Please subscribe to CB99 videos. Take care. Bye.